Developing right now, a man steals a mother's minivan this morning in Clinton Township with her four year old girl still inside and drops the child off soon after. Police said the girl's mother was dropping off one of her children at their grandmother's house at around 7 a.m. That's when a man on a bike rolled up and stole the vehicle with the child still inside. The child was found again just shortly after that, but police are continuing to search for the suspect. That's where local force Nick Monticelli picks up the story and are police closing in at all, Nick? Yeah, that's a good question, Rod. And just a quick note there. The mother was actually picking up her son from this home, grandma's home right behind me. So she was doing that and just going quickly inside. So her four year old daughter stayed inside of the van running, watching a movie inside the driveway. That is when this person, a crime of opportunity, riding a bicycle down the street, jumped in and took off. And we were saying dropped that child off. He essentially kicked her out of the van and abandoned her at 14 Mile Road in Gratiot. I will never, ever leave them in the car, whether it's raining, snowing, whatever the weather, they're coming with me. The fear and anguish Brandon McPherson went through this morning is almost the worst thing any parent can go through. Around 7.30, she stopped by Grandma's house to pick up her son for school. Her daughter, four-year-old Brooklyn, stayed in the van. And I heard a car reversing very fast, and I was like, oh my God, please don't tell me it's my van. I looked and I seen it in the road and I just took off running, screaming that my baby's in the car. Whoever stole their town and country minivan likely knew there was a little one in the back for close to half an hour. Nobody had any idea where the van or Brooklyn went. The fear of not knowing, is she okay? Is he, is he hurting her? Is she safe? Fortunately, the suspect opted to let Brooklyn out. Unfortunately, he abandoned her near 14 Mile in Gratiot, but many people saw her alone and called police. I just, I fell to my knees and I thank God it was, it was the best thing I've ever heard. Now Brooklyn is a little shaken, but will be okay. Mom, though, might be worse off. You may think your neighborhood's safe, like I thought this neighborhood was safe, but really there is no safe neighborhood. The grandparents, guardians, anybody that this can happen to anybody at any time. Now, I do want to point something out here that little Brooklyn lost something very important to her and the Clinton Township Police Department replaced it. There was a really cool show here. We're going to show you what that was coming up on Local 4 News at 5 o'clock and what they did that really brought a smile to this little girl's face. I'm live in Clinton Township, the Camonicelli, Local 4.